Hello, and welcome back to the episode 39 of the Witch Wild Hunt. Going further with our adventures. Guided by Kareem Tilly, the Witcher had a dream. In it, Sir. We are escaping from the Witcher place, from the Witcher Hunter's place. This is where we split up. But first, let's burn this shack down. Agreed. We've left too much evidence. Yeah. But I also need to blow off some steam. Thank you. I was exactly wondering what are we going to do with the body. You cannot impersonate uh, uh, like someone if you if you kind of know that this person is uh, you know dead. That should do it. I'm going. You should too. Mm-hmm. Not about to use the teleport though. See you, Triss. Ah, that's how you disappear. Now, how do I uh, leave the place? Should have thought about it sooner, you know? Yeah, okay. Ah, crap. You there! Mr. Roven wants a word! Ah, okay. Alright. Impatient uh. old bastard. What? Nothing. Be there soon. Who do I spy? Why, it's Geralt of Rivia. <sighs> will you stop following me already? I will, soon as you tell me where my treasure is. Me and Menga didn't see eye to eye. How badly? Badly. I suppose that explains the smoke. My treasure's not in there, is it? Burning with the witch hunters. Didn't see it anywhere. And 20 tons of gold is hard to miss. You mean to say you've come to me empty-handed? First off, you came to me. Second, I do have something in my hand. The key to a vault, founded on Menga. A vault? That I need to find on my own? You've not made things much easier for me. Give me that. That's all you're gonna say? No wry remark, no scintillating joke. <laughs> you want a knee slapper? Fine, I'll tell you one. Ready? Oh yes. You please. lied to me ah, shit. again. What? You knew from the start who robbed me, but you didn't deign to share that information with me. How do you find out? I asked the questions here. Not true. That was a statement. Come on, Dijkstra. This tough guy act doesn't work on me. We're both adults. Act like one. <laughs> ah, Geralt. I should have you strangled, but I like you, you bastard. Yeah, sure. I like you too. You count without a county? Now that we've professed our feelings for each other, how'd you figure it out? Since from the start you were up to something. You didn't haggle about your pay. And then I heard from my sources that Margrave Henkel and Dandelion had rubbed elbows. Wasn't hard to connect the dots. And now, time to settle things. That a threat? Quite the contrary. You helped me, Witcher. So in spite of everything, you've earned your reward. Don't bother. I know what happened to Dandelion. 
Then take my coin. I always pay my debts, even to liars. And a final humble plea. Don't try to fool me again. Ever. It's not like I actually wanted to fool you in the first place. Bastards deserved it. Okay, so we have to look for Dudu. We also have to look for Philippa. We also need to meet Tris at her hideout, which is over there. Is it uh, this, uh, yeah, separated uh, part of the city? I mean, it looks like it. Um, but to be fair, I wanna, I wanna see what happened with Priscilla. So how about I go burn, to the docks? Buggers, like all the poor folk you've burned. And from there we'll fast travel to the Timerian secret camp. Help! Save me! I'm dying of poverty! Those ah. are not the I also need to go here to check out this uh, um, notice nice board. Yeah, no notes here. Okay. I believe it's it's the big ones that give you uh, quests and contracts. It was to the north. Yeah. Now, a little bit of a miscellaneous day today, so maybe we'll clean up uh, a couple of those. Slow now. Not your lucky day. And there should be the last one, right? There is just three of them. Well, I picked up some wolves, Bane. Uh, some dusts, uh, some armor, some oil, glyphs and runestones. Now, if we go to the south of it, should come across another point of interest. What will that be? Some monster nest or... Ah, a place of power. That is a good find.
magic. A place of power. With that out of the way, let's check out our map. So there is a vehicle bot residence. And then from the hideouts, we can go directly to this stuff. Move it! Oh, alright. Let's go. Straight through the forest. I mean, why not, right? That's the whole reason why I have a horse. It's full of monsters and traps. We've dragged out four wounded, and there's near a dozen corpses still down there. I don't give a shit. We've orders to search this cave, and that's what we'll do. We'll deal with the witches, then we'll come for you, don't you worry. They're Chest completely easy. crashed. Ribs must I have pierced the lungs. Ready. Board I could spew. Oh, flesh charred to the bone shit. in places. Scrum before I lose my patience. Got a foolproof method for exercising witches. So I believe that's the entrance, right? Well then, let's go and check this out. Wait, talk to the witch hunters? Uh, they are not the pleasant folk. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe go fuck yourself. White one. Devil's spawn. Having trouble? Nothing fucking but. One ploughing trouble after the other. But what's it to you? Who are you? Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. Radovid sent me. No, oh, it's you. I've been waiting for you. Word was you hadn't been able to get inside. Till yesterday, when we found this. Doesn't look like much, but it's got power of some sort. Opens the entrance. Great. I'll take that now, if you don't mind. Here, choke on it, you twit. Key to her hideout. Okay. Think Philip is still inside? That we don't know. Only certain thing is, she was there at some point. Certain? How's that? We've been after her since Loch Muin. Poking out her eyes weren't enough. Radovid should have gutted her there and then. As it is, she turned into an owl and fled. Flew across Kedwin and Redania. Then, tucked herself away here. 
What can I expect to find inside? Everything. Anything. It's an old elven temple. The witch Isleheart turned into her hideout. Look at him. Fell into some magic trap. Then monsters attacked him. Barely got out alive. Any of your men still down there? A dozen or so went in. They's all that came out. Rest are probably dead. Oh, that sounds uh, terrific. Still in there. Don't count on anyone going in to retrieve your corpse. Yeah. Aren't you charming? What do you reckon? Think he'll find something? That could. Gotta be some mechanism that opens this door. Missing one tile. for me to move around. Are uh, we not going to examine the corpse? At least some of them. Portals. Great. And the witch hunters probably messed with them. Works. Who would have thunk? nothing I guess eight portals make my stomach turn a remix it's edge afraid this is an owl feather those are corpses Expected as much. They love places like this. Somehow I doubt that's all the neckers in here. I think there are much more. That one should work now. Did it activated the portal? Nice, I guess. Stay back, not one step closer. Sheathe that before you hurt yourself. Wait, wait, wait. You, 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 that witcher the king was supposed to send? Guessed it. You should know by now how dangerous this place is. On a way up above with the others. Not a chance. Those cowards ran at the first whiff of monsters. I made a stiffer stuff. 
Yeah, sure. Besides, something big set to happen here. I just know it. I learn what it is. Radovid will appreciate it. King will promote me. Maybe even give me a medal. What's the big event that's supposed to happen? Uh, don't know the details, but I came across Philippa Eilhart's notes. Mentioned Ida Emian, Margarita Lowe and Teal, Francesca Finderbear, and Frangela Vigo. As I see it, they aim to meet here. Think Philip is still here? Can't really know. Sure, we searched a few caverns, but hidden nooks abound. If someone wanted to hide in here, they could easily. Even if they weren't an owl. All right, let's get you out of here. Told you already, no chance. Besides, the teleport's power cell. I broke it off. We have to wait till they come for us. Got no choice. Nobody's gonna come for us. Give me the crystal, I'll get us out of here. But the monsters? I'll defend you. What if you can't? I'm a weed sure. Be a good little hunter and give me the crystal. I am a good little hunter. There you go. Stubborn as hell though. Where does this thing go? Where did the Philippa? Dear Philippa, as I write this, I'm sipping your favorite cocktail on the terrace of my father's Medina estate and wondering what the devil are you thinking? I'd understand if you'd simply grown bored of me with me. I'd accept if it if uh, it had turned out that the pair we made was not to your liking, or you had found yourself a younger, prettier model. But for the love of the bleeding gods, Dijkstra? That, with all due respect, pot bellied swine over me? I do not know if you have been testing new concoctions that have addled your mind, or if perhaps this is another one of your games. Yet even if you must seek intimacy with it primitive for political reasons, I do not see why this should mean the end of our relationship. After all, it would not be the first time we would hide our love. Interesting. Philippa dumped some woman for Dijkstra. Another feather. Doubt Philippa had an aviary. These are signs of polymorphy. Activated. Oh, the dude go back? I'll just wait here. They'll come for me. Eh, okay. And I guess I have a portal of mine to follow. That's how you're supposed to do it. Huh. 
Another feather. Doubt Philippa had an aviary. These are signs of polymorphy. Yeah, but there is also uh, this tunnel, right? And there is also this uh, laboratory. With yet another portal, though. Another inactive portal, missing its power cell. Maybe the Neckers took a liking to it. Well, that explains why I need to go to the tunnel then. Power cell, got it. I believe this is it in this little area. Just a small detour after the power cell. Does it activate the portal behind me, by the way? Yes, it does. Gotta be the lowest level. Yeah, and I also see a bunch of bodies here. This looks like the place where, you know, those bodies burned heavily. Ah. I don't need any horse blinders. I believe I have plenty of my own. Tracker's gauntlets... No thank you. But those things, yeah, those I will take. Concerned about a bunch of charred bodies, right? Hmm. Yeah, we have other yeah, things to be worried about. Have a sentry, of course. Okay. You are a powerful little beast. Mm. 
but Irden to the wind. This is a big cave system, I must say. Is there anything here? Oh, a chest. And some barrel. Oh, why? 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 Why, do, why, why did I take that? Why? fought someone, or used them in her experiments. Pearls of the North Oxenford. Care for your sword, soldier. Smoking pipe. Sure. those things. Uh, okay, let's use my Witcher senses. What do I spy with my Witcher eye? Blood-stained surgical instruments. Philippa operated on someone here. Notes. Charred. Almost completely. Can't read a thing. Hmm. What's this? Aniseed and birch bark. Powerful disinfectant. Teleportation is uh, A megascope. Scorched. Oh, yeah, a megascope. Soot. Maybe yeah. one of the crystals survived. A megascope. Scorched. Covered in soot. Maybe one of the crystals survived. Crystal from a megascope. Heavily chipped. Triss will know what to do with this. Anything else in here? Oh, we are done. Feather. Doubt Philippa had an aviary. These are signs of polymorphy. I mean, if you say so, I trust you. I mean, you're the expert here, so. How many portals are there? Should be 
to the last one, right? Yeah. You should have gone after him. Prefer to come up, inform you. Besides, he'll come back this way. He's got to. Ah, there he is now. You're alive. Find anything? Dust, dirt, and a megascope crystal. Whatever the hell that is. But, good chance is important. Hand it here, we'll see the king gets it. Um, nah, I don't think so. Forgetting yourself. Save your orders for your men. As you wish. Grab him! You Calm down, fire. I want him alive! Shut up and fight. Alive! Why do they have black magic dolls? I'll take it shackles. You never know when you need them, so... I must say, I don't like Radovid, like, at all. He seems like a madman. Uh, he probably is. And I uh, don't feel any bit comfortable uh, following his uh, orders, so, uh, yeah, you know. So we do need to go and talk to Trees, right? Right. Um. Oh, then perhaps that's what we will do. I mean, if Radovid asks why the hell I slashed his man, I'd say, well, man, you asked me uh, to find Philippa, but here people are just getting, they're just simply getting in the way. I, I'd love to find Philippa for you, but how can I work when you people stand in the way of my work? A witcher. They Don't took my shiny things, that will uh, put me on trail. They uh, they boss me around, and I, I did not work for them. I do not work for them. I, I work. I was command commanded by you, right? So that's dance. I never was here. Wait, how do I... I'm here? Yes? Who are you here for? Triss. Told her from the start. No men, no pets. Tis a decent house for decent folk. Don't worry, won't stay long. Yeah. 
Yeah, th this might be a decent house, but it's tilted, like, like heavily tilted. It, it like whoa. Geralt, How I do you sleep problem. here? Can we talk? Um, you have a megascope thingy here as well. Please don't explode in it. Yes, Geralt. Feel all right? Hmm. So so. Why do you ask? I'm worried for you, obviously. Been wondering. How's your hand? Your fingers? They'll heal. Listen, it was my idea. I knew exactly what I was getting into. Don't need to worry about me. I was still worried. When you slit Menga's throat, and then... You were fierce. Never seen that side of you. What would you have had me do? Conjure up a cloud of butterflies? Not what I mean, and you know it. I'm a little worried how it might affect you. Well, yeah. I'd probably relive it in my dreams if I wasn't already having nightmares about mages roasting on pyres. Okay, that's a good argument, okay. See, you kept the Rose of Remembrance I gave you in Flotsam. Seems so long ago. Probably because so much has changed. So, sentimental value. That why you kept it? Partly. Though, more as a warning. Ouch. Been in Novigrad long? Long enough to know how not to get caught and survive. And before you came here, where were you? Oh, places. Where I managed to get by without your help, too. Which doesn't mean I'm not happy to see you. Spoke with Radovid. Offered me a contract. To find Philippa. The bastard. Wasn't enough that he poked her eyes out. Probably wants to torture her some more. You turned him down, of course. No. Geralt, you know what he did to her. Relax. See, I figured if I agreed, I could look for her without his men getting in my way. Fact is, I'm curious to know what happened to her. So? Learn anything? Even better. Found this. A megascope crystal. Hmm, it's damaged, but it could still work. And Francesca's Ooh. equally hesitant. Neither she nor Ida wishes to decide blindly. They'll stop hesitating as soon as we convince Kira and Fringilla. Fringilla's on our side. She'll join us as soon as she's finished some business in Nilfgaard. Wonderful. That leaves Kira. The problem is, I've still no notion where she could be. Yennefer and Triss. Yennefer's never belonged to the Lodge. And Triss? Well, we shall see. I must regain my vision. I can go to Novigrad, then see Arthur de Valista. The word is, Triss is also carousing about the city. You still insist? Phil, pardon my saying so, but you will never regenerate your eyes on your own. Vilgefortz did it. I'm employing the same method, cultivating tissue on precious stones. It's madness. You will need advanced power. You'll put yourself in great danger. That's it. That's all I could recover. That is probably why we found the blooded uh, crystal over there, right? Of some, of some, of some stone or whatever. I get that right? Philippa says she wants to restore her vision? Seems she was planning to grow tissue on precious stones. Makes sense. Found agates covered in blood in her hideout. If she pulled it off, she'd only be the second person in the world to do so. But the bit about the lodge, that's what I found interesting. Meaning what exactly? The names they mentioned. All the most powerful sorceresses. Former members of the Lodge. They clearly mean to revive it. That good or bad? Depends for who. Philip has always said that if magic perishes, so shall this world. And the Lodge was to protect the mages and their interests. Radovid and the Emperor, on the other hand, would not be pleased. Both would have to respect our opinions, and neither likes to share power. Our opinions? You join them, really? No, I've got other plans. 
So, what will you do with the crystal? Haven't decided. Ed Radovid would be very interested in it. You're not gonna give it to him, are you? Um... I mean, it will not point him to the location of Philippa, as far as I can understand. Hmm... Well, I, I see why I shouldn't give it to Radovid, because he's a... Uh... I don't like Radovid, so... Ah, I keep it. Probably better if you keep it. Much better. It'll be safe with me. I'll try to cast a diagnostic spell. Maybe learn something more. Good luck. Come on, save my game. Thank you. Yes, Geralt? What did you want to talk about? I got a strange message. I don't quite know what to think. Who is it from? Ingrid Vagelbud's servant. Apparently, Lady Vagelbud's prepared to donate a tidy sum. She wants to help mages escape from Novigrad. Guessing this wouldn't be a selfless act of charity. You guess right. And that's my problem. Vagelbud needs a favor from me. No details in the letter, unfortunately. I'm supposed to meet the servant at the fish market. Says he needs to explain everything face to face, but these days I can't be sure meeting him's a good idea. Who's this Ingrid Vagelbud? The Vagelbuds are one of the city's most influential families. Somewhat atypical, the women have been in charge for generations. Patricia Vagelbud's the current mater familius. Ingrid's her daughter. Know her personally? No, seen her, that's all. And I've heard rumors. She's admired in Novigrad for her business acumen, and adored for the lavish balls she throws at the family estate outside town. Though the balls probably serve her business interests in some way. Hmm. What's the difference between those two? I mean, if I propose help, I, I would propose Tris to stay out of it. Hmm. And for me to go to check it out. I mean... Hmm. Don't like this at all. But you seem determined. Not about to let you deal with it alone. Thank you. The servant. How are you supposed to contact him? Said I'd recognize him. He'll be in a blue tunic, have a load of keys strapped to his belt. I'm supposed to ask him about the price for his trout. Whose idea you think this was? The servants or Vagelbuds? My bet's on Ingrid. Highborn damsels have a lot more time than their servants to read adventure novels. Think it'll be better if I talk to the mystery man in the blue tunic? He's expecting to meet me. You just wait nearby. I'll make sure that note didn't come from the witch hunters. Then you come in. Mm-hmm. Fine. Let's meet there. I wonder if he's going to be the only person in the in the fish market. Like, it's getting dark right now, right? So there are not not, not many servants over there. There are not many merchants as well. And now this will be the single dude. Girl kicked his face in. Lost oh. so many tooth. I've had enough of living. Who can afford a witcher in this day and age? Take good care of yourself. Geralt of Rivia. I buy tomorrow what you can buy today. No. Oh no. Man in the black, uh, in the blue tunic. Lots of blue jerkins. Interesting. What's it like beheading a king? Well, you do have a lot of keys. Yeah. Know where I can get the 
Best price on trout? Perhaps. But it wasn't you I was to meet, sir. Want to talk to the letter's recipient? I gotta be present. Caution would advise... Caution's advising you not to argue right now. Trust me. Seems I've got no choice. Come with me. This way. It's not far. Oh, lovely trifles. Mm. Oh. say so. Mm. Ah. That's it. Get him. Help me! It's all me. Leave it to me. No! Thank you. Let's go. Like a raw wolf. What do they want from you? Not no your clue. guys? First time I've laid eyes on them. Maybe. Well, recently someone's been trying to question our messengers about the young Count. Hold on. Where's Miss Merigold? You would come alone, Miss. If not for him, that trio would have dragged you in for questioning. The tall one was Valdo Morris. Works for the witch hunters. Aye, you're surely right, miss. I... It just weren't what I expected since Lady Vagel, bud. Now that we're past the initial courtesies, maybe you can tell us who you are. Lady Vagel, bud's valet. I... I meant you no offense, sir. Why wouldn't Lady Vagel, bud meet with me personally? She was afraid they'd follow her. Been a nervous wreck of late. So what's this about? Be straight. Lady Vagelbud's son. He's the problem. Master Albert's taken an interest in alchemy. Temple Guard's gotten wind. Wouldn't worry about the guard. But since the Mage Hunters tried to grab you, I'd say Albert's in serious trouble. Aye. Lady Vagelbud bought off the guardsmen. But since the hunters paid for every mage revealed to him. Guardsmen took a bribe from the frightened family, then whispered a word to the hunters anyway. How'd Ingrid Vagelbud know to contact Triss, that Triss was the right person? We learned Miss Merigold had helped Myra Base disappear once the witch hunters were onto her. Myra provided Lady Ingrid with magical assistance on a few occasions with Milady's um, afflictions. Makes sense. Myra mentioned treating a highborn lady to me once. Seems Albert needs to disappear as soon as possible. I can arrange that. Think young Vagelbud can slip out of the house unnoticed? Tain't that simple, sadly. Master Albert's in hiding at the Vagelbud's country estate. Lady Ingrid's got the notion she can get him out quietly, wants to throw a lavish masquerade ball. Am I supposed to attend? Help him escape? Aye. We'll not manage without you, miss. Lady Vagelbud fears the help's being watched. Hmm. If the Hunters are after Albert, I doubt some merrymaking will distract them. Geralt, a ball at the Vagelbuds is hardly some merrymaking. Word is, at the last one, they served a hundred different desserts, and the fireworks boomed from dusk till dawn. What with the war and all, Milady's ordained but 85 desserts this time. Won't be no candy petals of blue roses from Nazaire. The roses have become dreadfully hard to come by. Aww. Oh, I'd love to see it all. Expect any trouble during the ball? Hardest part will be to keep Master Albert's departure a secret from his grandmother. Is that necessary? Lady Patricia's a fervent believer of the eternal fire, knows naught about Albert's interests in alchemy. Luckily, the elder Lady Vagelbud's a rare visitor to the country residence. Truly an atypical family. I'm not one to judge, sir. Hope we won't have to stay till the end. You're coming with me? Of course I am. Not about to send you into what could prove to be the lion's den by yourself. Think about it. 85 desserts. While you're still trying to keep your waist at 22 inches. Geralt, please. How do we get to the residence? Your invitation. Take it. Guard at the gate will have instructions for you. You're to wear a fox mask, alright? Good luck to you. A fox mask. Eh, let's go directly. Think we can head there now? You're kidding, right? We have to prepare. Change clothes, most importantly, buy our masks. I bet you can Damn get it. everything we need for the ball at Ellie House shop. You know it? 
Been there before. Eliel's a friend of Dandelion's. Just masks, right? Probably don't need to wear a doublet, do I? A doublet, Geralt. And it's not up for discussion. Take care of that, then come and see me. Damn. Greetings. Oh. Just a bit more and I'll drop this job. We can go at it here. Oh, oh my God. The yeah. Reaper's company. No. Oh, fuck. Don't write him now. <laughs> Got my eye on you, white one. If I was saving my money for buying costumes and masks, oh god damn. I hope that fancy stuff is not too expensive. It's not like I'm having any issues financially on, on this level of difficulty. But still, I would be pissed if that costs like maybe a hundred or more. Uh... Ah, there you are. Greetings. Come to look over my spring collection, perhaps? Glad to take a glance at what you got. Of course, please do. If anything chafes or pinches, I can alter it on the spot at no charge. Once I'm done, it'll feel like you're wearing nothing at all. Oh my. And that's okay. Fox Max mask for trees, bird, arlequin, and wolf mask. Well, obviously we we'll buy that one. Now we need a doublet, right? Jesus, why is it so expensive? So long. Let's remove the mask for now. Hey -ya. Elvin blood, eh? Go with this either. I was fail, I'll never let money, your kind in, no regret. Suddenly, up he pops and heals me. Spare a copper or two. Slow now. <coughs> Made himself at home. 
track mud in all over me floors. Maybe she'll finally move in with him. High time. Oh, I see you also put a nice dress. Oh my! Certainly took my request to heart. Mean you weren't being serious? Still got time to change. Don't you dare! You look great! You get everything? Learn anything else about Albert? Well, almost none of the mages have heard of him. An amateur, I guess. So why the interest? Temple guards first, then hunters. Uh, he's easy prey, and that's exactly why we should help him. Hmm. Everything's ready. We can go. A shame events like this are so rare. Without them, I'd never get to see you dressed up. Uh, damn, doublets chafing my armpits. And it feels like they sewed wires into this. I'll be sure to admire your valiant suffering the whole time. Well then. Shall we go? Yeah, the faster we start, the faster we end, so... Greetings, my lord, my lady. We're Lady Ingrid Vagelbud's guests. Your invitation, please. All's in order. You'll find Lady Vagelbud in the estate's yard. Look for the parrot mask. Uh, one more thing. Uh, leave your swords here, please. I specifically removed them. Mm. Fine. A pleasant evening to you both. That is the reason why I invest so much I in, been outside the city in, ages. in science. But how could he? With that scrawny harlot! Oh, come now, don't cry. After all, he's not the only man in the world. But he's a baronet. Where will I find another baronet? Hello, Vivian. No use pretending you don't know me. Is that any way to treat an old mate? Refuse to acknowledge him? There's been a mistake. I don't know you, sir. Don't be foolish, Vivian. I'd recognize that mane anywhere. You might play the great dame now, but before that Baron Edward something pulled you from the gutter, you were a common... Enough. The lady said she doesn't know you. Who's this? The new one? Older than the last, it seems. A decrepit, moss-covered prick. So, the less they can, the more they pay. Is that it? Damn it, you piss me off. Let's go, Triss. Wouldn't want to make a scene. Vivian! Hey! Oh, I liked you much better when you worked the carriages outside the passive flora. Come back, you coward. What a jackass. I'm not done with you! Kraken! My, is he ever sorted? Well, with that uh, nice scene, I'd like to wrap the episode around here. I think it was a nice one. Uh, and we will continue with this uh, ball masquerade uh, entertainment for each folks uh, kind of thing a little bit later. Uh, for now, I'd like to say thank you for staying with me. I hope you enjoy my company and my gameplay. In such case, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel, or otherwise let me know down in the comments what I can improve for you. I hope to see you next time. Have a nice day out there. Bye!